Will Troy make it out of the Snowpocalypse 2019 alive and unscathed? Find out at the end of this vlog. Stay tuned. Good morning, it is still a white wonderland of fluffiness outside. Dad, don't vlog me. Don't vlog you? He's, he's in the bathroom. Okay, I won't, trust me. I'm not sure if, um, if this has grown or not. I mean, it's the morning. I don't, I think it has grown a little bit. Maybe it has, I don't know. But it's dripping right now, so I think that everything is gonna start melting away. And this guy, we're gonna miss this guy. We love you. <coughs> love you too. For coughs and all. Let's make the day happen. I'm gonna get this guy back. He doesn't have school today, you guys saw that yesterday. Because of the snow, we can't play in the snow, so we're not going to school, and that's good. So I don't want to go to school today. I just want to stay home and be sick. <laughs> oh, all right. All right, guys. Bye-bye. Let's make the day happen. Wow, you guys hear that? The birds are singing. Snow land outside, huh? No, what? It's a snow earth. It's a snow earth? Yes. It's like a big marshmallow world. Yes. It's covered with marshmallow. Phoenix has been dropped off. We're gonna let the work day start. The work day starts now. seen the freeway during the day I think ever which is good oh my god it's hot in here oh. 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 oh man roasting like a marshmallow get it marshmallow world roasting like a yeah I thought of that all by myself I want to back up because I don't know what this guy's doing here he's sliding down this hill <laughs> I want to stay clear from him. Head north on South G Street. All right. South 21st Street. So like I was saying, here we go. Troy's going to try a hill. We'll see what happens. This will be my first hill of the year. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Look at that. Woo! Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that was awesome. That was purely awesome. If you can see the joy on my face right now. Back home temporarily. It has not stopped snowing all day, but the temps are 31 degrees Fahrenheit, negative one degrees Celsius. So they're right there at that cusp of freezing. But with the, the solar energy a little bit, it, it's still, the, the roads are kind of sloppy in some places. But wow, it's coming down. It makes for good video. <laughs> all right. Got to get back out there though, guys, so we'll see if something else happens. Ooh. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. The landscape is pretty. The billions of flakes coming down are pretty. Which, didn't they dispel that? The, the, the old saying is that no two snowflakes are alike. So every single one of the snowflakes that has ever fallen, ever, or will ever fall, are not the same. Oh shoot. The guy in front of me just 
like uh, started going off the road a little bit. Maybe I should turn the camera around. All right, I've made it here to my appointment. It's snowing still. Quite heavily, actually. I hope I can get out of here. <laughs> oh man, there's a bunch of stories in this vlog today. Will Troy make it out of the Snowpocalypse 2019 alive and unscathed? Find out at the end of this vlog. Stay tuned. Another job completed, just have to bill out get out of here and we're not buried in the snow yet we still have a little ways before we're buried got a long ways before we're buried we're okay we're all all right hello Wisconsin but before I take off out of here I'll give you an update on my crack so it started down here and now it has proceeded to come all the way over to here but oh no wait there's more it's also veered off of here and went all the way over to there now. But you actually probably can watch it because I'm heating up the windows. It was right here when I first started the truck right now before I'm leaving this appointment. But it's right there, it's gonna move. I should do time lapse of my crack. And we no longer have snow, now we have rain. So you know what that means. I haven't even heard anybody say anything about it yet. But all the snow is on the ground and now you have rain. Uh, the next thing we're going to have is flooding. Welcome to Washington. Much weather to change? Wait five minutes. It might rain again. Literally it's five minutes later and it's decided to strain and basically start snowing again. So we waited five minutes and the weather did change. Oh my god, that's hilarious. I'm laughing on the inside and the outside. Of course, dang it, this person on my left in the turn lane right in front of me, well, he's kind of on my left, but he's in, the guy that's turning right there, he stopped for crows that were in the middle of the road. Those crows don't want to move. Watch. Oh, now they move. <laughs> Last guy stopped for him. Bowling for buzzards! Oh, see, they know. They know my truck, they know to get out of the way. All right. Fun wintertime driving. It started snowing, it, but you guys saw that. That's probably the last thing I filmed. And then it started raining, and then it was raining here, and then this started happening. I've already knocked off the carport roof, so that's how much it's snowed since, uh, man, freaking apocalypse. So I'm on my way to Fred Meyer, which is across town, um, to get uh, propane. They are the only people in town that have propane that I've been able to reach, just in case we lose power again, and... They're holding it for me, so I gotta get there. I can't believe they're holding it for me, they're so nice. probably the only bottle of propane in town. I don't know how I did it, but I did it. Oh. Which is funny, because a week from now they're gonna restock and there's gonna be a million of them out there.
finally fell. You guys have no idea how long I've been waiting for that piece to fall. What I do for awesome B-roll. <laughs> Buffy! Good girl! Come on. You're gonna come in here. You're gonna relax. I'm gonna turn the heater on in here. And I'm going to forget about the weather. I'm shutting off. I'm turning off. I'm turning off the weather. I don't care right now. I have other things I need to get done. I need to start editing. I've got like a metric crap ton of, of clips to, to deal with tonight. So we're going to chill out. I've got the warm coffee over there. I got the tunes playing out there. And I'm going to shut the weather off just like that. Gone. Not talking about it anymore. I'm going to talk about other things like editing and finances and cracked windshields. <sighs> Oh, I don't know what I want to do about that. But, uh, it's going to have to get taken care of one way or the other. Are you going to help with that? That would be great. Go and pimp yourself on the side of the road and say, Hey, man. <laughs> hey, man. My master needs a new windshield. No. Oh, look at that. She's just giving me the cold shoulder. She's like, yeah, whatever. <laughs> All right. Edit time. And now edit time is basically over. Now it's time for cock. Commenting on comments. It's an acronym. C-O-C. -C. See, it's right here. I'm putting it right on my big head tonight. First comment of the night, back on top. Nice to see you again, Chuck. AKA Capzone 2. Dude, what is up, man? That's so nice to see. Joseph Blau, Trip27, Natalia Paradiso, amongst others. You guys are waiting for the snow to hit you guys. Oh, Halloween Fur, you also say that you got another six inches, too. Oh, my goodness. Uh, Ricky R., uh, here in California, we finally got a good snowpack in the mountains. Going to try and take the kids up there this weekend. Awesome. Have fun. Hopefully, hopefully one day I'll be able to take Phoenix up there when he's not sick and go sledding. It'll be fun. I had Carrie Ann Olson when I was in school. I love snow days. I did when they happened. I just didn't like it when I had to make them up. Carrie Ann Olson, they gave you crutches just for an ingrown toenail? No, 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 no. See, what happened is, is my toenail, you know the big heavy school doors at, at school? Duh. Um, I was goofing around in like 7th, 8th grade, I think it was, and one of those, I was chasing this kid, and the big heavy school door went over my shoe, and it, it got my, my big toenail, and it ripped the toenail up and off the bed. And then when it grew back, it grew back and grown. And I tried, you know, shoving um, cotton balls, you know, underneath it to lift it up. It never helped, never helped. So what they did is they cut half the nail all the way back to the bed. And they they killed the root, the root, the root, the root um, of the nail on that side. So I've got like a, a skinnier uh, toenail now. So when they did that and they, they cut all that out of there, yes, I had to keep it elevated. So I had to go to school with crutches. They let me use some crutches. Hope that didn't gross anybody out. I hope nobody was eating right now. Uh, Nick Gerald, are you and Phoenix going to build a snowman? Well, no, not this week. Darn. He was sick, so he had to stay inside. Shay's tiny corner of the interwebs. Has anyone ever woken up, gotten ready for school, and realized it was a Saturday or Sunday? You know, I don't think I ever did that. I do know that I've woken up late before, and I've seen the alarm clock, and then it clicks in your head what time it is, and then just that... That moment of panic sets in. It's like, you're up, you're like, getting stuff done, you're running around. Oh, I hate that. That's like the worst thing to wake up to, is being late. And if you're a parent, the sound of a baby puking. They should make that into an alarm clock, because I guarantee it. If you're a parent, you know what I'm talking about. Your baby pukes, and you're like, you're up. <laughs> It'll just like that. Okay, I don't know why I'm yelling. I'm getting really excited about this. About baby puke? Bren22999, you dog. I went out with a chick that had a split tongue. No complaints, nothing but great experiences. All right, moving on. Real fan Jason, oh, real fan Jason, I'm sorry. Rant incoming. You talked about snow. I totally feel your pain. At least this here I know isn't going to last for another week, I don't think. So it, I can see how it would be crappy to have it just last for so long. Mr. Bro, thanks for telling me to hit the bell. YouTube unbelled me again. Second time it's happened. Happened on several other channels too. Yeah, so if you guys haven't done it, hit the bell. The bell is like where? Down there somewhere, I think? Because then you get like, if whatever you're subscribed to, you can get a text notification, an email notification when the vlog goes live, and you can try to be first. 
that's always fun. Uh, Nicole Flynn, I love Phoenix vlogs. They're always fun and they're the best. Whirly Bird Productions, we aren't getting any snow, just light rain, but oddly enough, every time you get rain, wind, etc., 40% or so of the time we get it a couple days later. The same thing with Angie and I. Usually she'll get the weather and then that weather like anywhere from like one to one to two days, we'll have it down here. Trip 27, you say that you still think that I had Buffy rigged up uh, in the GoPro harness wrong last time and that's why it was so wiggly on her. Well, I don't think it matters really where it's located because the haunches do this, the whole body does this when the dog's walking and that footage just goes back and forth. I don't, I don't think it, I, mean, I, I need to retry it, but no matter what, having this camera with the image stability is like, it's a freaking godsend. I love this camera for that. There are a couple things about it that I don't like. The boot up time, like the time it takes to turn the camera on and start recording is a lot longer. I miss having a, um, a zoom and the sound is kind of, it's not perfect yet on the GoPro, but you guys have to admit the image is awesome and it can go underwater and it's durable and it's small and it's awesome. I love it. I'm still in love with it. And the final comment of the night, Joe Poppenhag and Troy, I see that Elvira's on your wall. Who are the other pictures of? It's been a while since I've done this, so let's go guys, let's take a look. So yes, this is Elvira. That was actually signed back in the 80s when I was a kid. Copyright 1984. Cassandra still looks the same. Uh, Debbie Gibson, personally signed. Rick Astley, yes, I was Rick Rolled. Um, Tyrone Lietzo, who is, uh, he was an actor on Wonder Falls. Uh, this one right here is Diane Franklin. She was um, on Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure, almost, uh, also in uh, Amityville. And this right, run, blah, 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 I do not say blah, blah, blah. Uh, Dee Wallace, the mother of E.T. Uh, Carolyn Deverna, who was also on Wonder Falls. Leanne Rimes, this is not personally autographed. Then this one right here is um, uh, a, a YouTuber that is a country singer. I'm just covering uh, my address right there. Uh, Taylor Edwards is her name. And then up here we have Lou Temple from The Walking Dead. And then up here we have Jessica Cameron and Mr. Ward, AKA Oscar from The Walking Dead. All right guys, happy haunting. Thanks so much for watching. I'm gonna get out of here. Buffy, can you say goodnight? Sit, speak. <laughs> Good girl. Good girl. That was her saying goodnight. Bye guys. Hey guys, happy hunting!